I don't like it. Hi guys, it's Max from HighOnAndroid.com where we get only Android every day. Anyway, today's video was gonna be temper glass for the S7 Edge unboxing video. Now the reason why I changed the title to do not buy temper glass for S7 Edge, it is because they are horrible. These Chinese companies making temper glass for the S7 Edge, also S6 Edge, any edge screen Samsung device. It's the same product. They've been branded as PayU, GPL, iCares. Basically, they're all the same thing. And these companies are making millions of dollars cutting out a piece of temper glass, selling it to you for 20 bucks. They're making a ton of money selling you these crapware, crap gadgets. And I'm just tired of that. Why are you selling these crap products? And that is why I'm making this video. All right, first I'm gonna talk about what's wrong with these temper glass. If you take a close Close look at the tempered glass there's this grainy finish all right that's not even adhesive the reason why it's there because it's not grainy it's gonna actually scratch the surface of your Gorilla Glass of your phone that's what happens a couple of years ago with Samsung's clear cases now they have that grainy finish all right that may work for clear cover cases but it doesn't work well for your phone obviously because that grain you can see through the phone now most youtube videos showing temper glass will not show it because on camera you really can't see it but if you see it in real life you'll see this grainy effect um rainbow effect it makes your awesome 1440p amoled display into a crappy like 720p HD. It looks horrible. I mean, some people can absolutely live with that and they absolutely need to have protection on their phone. These tempered glass will protect it well. The problem is it makes your AMOLED display to the point where it's completely useless. It just degrades the quality of the 1440 display. If you actually tried it in real life, you'll notice it. I just can't live with it. So I want to make this public message. Do not use, do not buy tempered glass. All right. It's just useless. All right. Number two, most of these tempered glass do not fit cases like VRS Design, Spigen, anything that wraps over your phone, it will not fit. In fact, most of them will pop out. They'll even crack. If you check out every YouTube video on tempered glass, and have them putting over a case, you'll notice that they either pop out, crack, makes them useless to use with a case. Now that beats the point of using tempered glass because having a case will protect your phone better because it'll protect the back, the sides, and the front. While the tempered glass may protect the front, you're leaving the rest of your phone vulnerable. But if you absolutely need to use your phone naked, you can live with the crappy display once putting on that tempered glass, go ahead. All right, third, once you put these temper glass on, the touch screen will work fine, all right, in the middle. And the edge screen works fine also. But the problem is when you start typing. Any letters on the edge screen are now nearly unresponsive. You'll have to press them much harder than normal. Pressing A normally will not register, maybe one out of five times. That is a huge problem when you're typing. It makes the screen useless. Now, the whole point of this video is to educate you so you don't end up spending $20 on a temper glass that is completely useless. And all of these temper glass are pretty much the same thing. A lot of the YouTube videos on temper glass will say the same thing as me, or they don't point out these important facts and try to sell you stuff. And by then you've already spent $20 on a temper glass that you put on your phone and you won't be able to return it. You know, maybe you'll be able to return it. All right, go look at every comment on these YouTube videos. Number one problem is a rainbow grainy effect. Number two problem, it doesn't fit most of the cases out there. Number three, it makes your touch screen unresponsive. Look at the comments written by people who actually bought that same product and you will see what I mean. All right, if you still do not believe me, go to Amazon and do a search for temper glass S7 Edge. You will see that every product has three stars or less. That is horrible for Amazon ratings, all right? And look at every comment there. Now there are some with four stars or five stars, but if you actually go click on their profile, you'll see that they're all fake reviews, all right? So I just wanted you guys to be aware of all these fake companies trying to sell you stuff with fake reviews 
basically they're making $20 a pop every time they sell you this. So if you absolutely need to protect your phone, buy a case like this, VRS Design. I've been using this since I've got the phone. I've dropped it a bunch of times, front, back, side. My phone is nearly 100% or by insurance, all right? Even cases will not protect certain drops. In that case, if you're prone to dropping a lot, maybe your job requires to be on a ladder, maybe you work for pg and &E. maybe you need to get a thicker case. Simply getting a thicker case will protect your phone better than getting a tempered glass that will only protect the front of the screen. I hate this crap gadget. So maybe tempered glass for regular flat screens are okay, and I've seen some good ones, but for the edge screen ones that I've seen, they're all horrible, so do not buy. You just saved a bunch of money by watching this video. So don't forget to hit the thumbs up for me. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, Instagram, Periscope. And as always, stay. Oh, man. I don't like it. Hi. Click here to subscribe. Click here to subscribe.